All right, we're live. Hey, this is crazy. So, uh, yeah, this is my little studio here, uh, my, my room, courtesy of Mitch Holloway. Thank you very much for the studio light, even though it's hotter. I don't know if you guys can hear my fan. Let me know if it gets too loud, but that's the only thing that's kind of stopping me from sweating right now. So uh, the classic, hey, guys, my signature catchphrase. Eddie from the Eddie Milanis Group here at the uh, Pinnacle Estate Properties in Westlake Village. I live in Sydney, though. But I want to say thank you guys very much for all the business and love and support you guys gave us in 2017. We're hoping we can do the same and do bigger, better things in 2018. So we owe it all to you guys. We appreciate everything that you guys have done for us and the referrals and tuning in. I'm so happy that you guys are loving the caravan videos. Um, so happy that you guys are loving the coming soon blogs. Again, we appreciate all your love and support. I'm going to kind of check it off. I learned this from Chris and Bonnie, you know, try to check off so I don't ramble. So we're going to go ahead and dive right in. So, you know, guys, I get a lot of questions. I want you guys to kind of share. If you guys can put in the Katie, Katie K, I appreciate that. That's one of the best questions. Um, you know, you know, what are the best improvements for your home to bring? Keep sending your questions. I get a lot of questions daily. The reason why I'm able to do these videos is because of uh, you guys. You guys ask me questions or just, you know, talking to people left and right. You know, we get some random questions. And there's no such thing as a stupid question because that's the only way I've learned my whole entire life. So please, guys, thank you for sharing it. Katie, thank you again for sharing that. That's an awesome one. That's a good idea. Um, please, please keep uh, keep letting us know what, uh, what other questions you guys want. So um, the other thing is, you know, just kind of what's going on with the market. One of the questions is all the time that we get here at the Eddie Milanis Group is when is a good time to sell? And, you know, everyone's got a, a cousins, it's a realtor, aunt or uncle, family member. Everybody knows a real estate agent. I mean, there's, we, there's a ton of them here just in see me alone. But, you know, a lot of people say it's the seasons. Hey, should we wait till, you know, spring, summer, fall, winter? You know, we kind of stress this out. Um to our clients is basically the right time is when you're ready. And that's something that can't be, you can dissect and I'll show you some crazy stats here about the California real estate market, it's insane. But again, to go back in there, the right time to sell is when you're ready. And and, and I keep saying that because we gotta have goals in life and, and, and selling your house, there has to be a goal at the other side. You know, right now you guys thinking about moving, a lot of people are living, leaving the state, like I'm not gonna get political or whatever, but, you know, I just got my car registration in the mail and my car's about three years, almost four years old. And I'm paying close to over $500. It's ridiculous. 600 bucks. It's crazy. So, you know, if you're moving out of state or you're, you know, what is your purpose? What are you guys going? Are you going to downsize? Do you want to move up? you got to factor in where is your next, where is your next chapter? Do you want to just, you know, hey, dealer's out. I'm cashing out. I'm renting and I'll figure it out. I think it's. It's not the right time or market. I think it's when the, you're the right time. It's the right time for you guys as a family, as yourself, as however you know, however you want to do it. That that is the most important thing is to look at the goals and see. It's human nature. Our job as realtors is to market your property aggressively. If you guys know my marketing, I want to talk about that. I do a lot of social media. I think that's huge. But you know, it's we want to get as much as we can because that's human nature. But I think it's what's the bottom line or what's what can I get away with or what's the least amount I can get to move me forward in whatever direction I want to choose, whether you're renting, whether you're you know selling or downsizing. So there's a lot to be said about that when you're ready. And the same thing I tell the other buyers, but I'll do another video about that. But it's finding out your goals, looking at the numbers, how much are you going to net out? If you're leaving out of state, you know, of course, man, you got California house, you're going to love that out of state. You know, there is certain states you, that are kind of similar to California, but once you get into California, you're moving out of state, you're looking pretty golden. Which kind of leads us into when is the right time to sell your house? Like if you were going to ask me that today and your goal is to move out of state or if your goal is to, you know, kind of cash out and just sit there on the sidelines and see what happens with this market. Right now, I would tell you today, put your house on the market. If you're downsizing or if you're moving up, just be patient, guys. I mean, for you guys that follow the real estate market, you know, and I'll show you these crazy stats in a little bit. There's no inventory. There's nothing out there. It's you know, I just pulled up some of the inventory yesterday and thinking uh, Simi Valley out of just single family residents, single family homes, there's only a total of 95 listings, Thousand Oaks, 95, Moore Park, 41, and Westlake was 91. I mean, we're talking about a population of over 100,000. Uh, for you guys that know this about me, I know some of you guys don't know this about me, but, you know, I've been, in, I've been licensed since 2003. This will be my 15th year in real estate selling. 
prior to that, I worked at Countrywide doing uh, foreclosures, bankruptcies, REOs. So I got a lot of knowledge about this. And it, it's just, it's insane to see these numbers. I mean, and which kind of leads us into, I want to show you guys this. Um, I'm very analytical. That's, sorry, I kind of spaced out, but I'm very analytical, guys. I was raised by an electrical engineer. If you guys have lived or if, if you know any engineers, God God bless you guys. Love you guys. You guys have your purpose. Uh, but, you know, it's either black or white and it's facts or fiction. There's no, there's no color. So it's a little bit of a mess up here. But uh, thank you, Dad. I appreciate that because I did get as over analytical. And uh, sometimes it's, uh, it's a blessing and a curse at the same time. But I do love looking at these numbers. So just, again, like if you were to ask me today, hey, Eddie, when's a good time to sell my house? Should I wait for winter? If you're moving out of state or you're cashing out, I'd say put your house up today because with those type of numbers and that type of inventory is, is crazy. There's nothing on the market. For you guys, that, again, I don't want to repeat myself, but just be patient. Like everything is meant to happen when it's meant to happen. I do believe in that. Um, it's something that we do stress to our clients because you're buying something that you can't return. It's not Target. You know, you can't have a receipt and be like, ah, it's 30 days. Sorry, I didn't like it. So take your time. But to circle back here, check out some of these stats. So California Association of Realtors put in a really good um, article here. And I'll email you. I'll drop that in the post. Or I'll drop that after a Facebook thing ends. Um, California Association of Realtors put a whole, came out a couple days ago, January 22nd right here. And it's all about the California market. And... Some of these facts, guys. I mean, California just as a whole, the median home price is five forty nine, five sixty, and that went up. You know, a half almost went up seven point six percent from two thousand and sixteen. That number is insane. It's crazy. That's that's not even Ventura County, and Ventura County numbers. I'll, I'll share you guys with Ventura in two thousand December in two thousand seventeen, and let me kind of get you guys with this. Well, I'll show you guys that stats. Don't focus, Eddie. Focus. Keep it together here. Hold on. Let me get you guys to this. This is a really good article. I mean, there's a lot of lot of crazy figures, but California is nothing but it's – if you want to get into California, you got to spend at least $550,000 for an entry-level home, if that, in certain areas. Um, and again, right here was a huge one that stuck out to me, and it's part of the slides. The housing inventory has hit the lowest observed in 13 years. And there's really, you know, it says two and a half months of supply. It, not really. It just depends on certain counties and, and where you're at. But so this is some of the slide. This is just California as a whole. And again, I just want to share this with you guys. Just, and I'll try to do it quick. But this is California. It just 2017 sales. How many? I mean, we went up. This is how many units, houses were sold in the whole entire state of California with the MLSs. Um, you see that's 420. The other one, the medium home price it has continued to skyrocket. So everybody that told you last year that you should have waited to buy, I mean, you missed out on some equity. I mean, it is what it is. Again, if it wasn't the right time, it, it wasn't the right time. But just over here, California as a whole is 510. Now, Ventura County, I don't have that slide, but Ventura County in 2017 was 645,000 in December 17. In 2016 in Ventura County was $589,150. Guys, that is insane. That's almost 10% appreciation. So, you know, it is, that is a lot of money, you know, a lot of money. So you guys have bought the last three to four years. Right now, you guys are sitting on some pretty good equity. Um, this is just kind of a chart here. You know, what's crazy in California, high end is, is definitely dominating. You know, that's all these ones went up million. These are the struggling ones, the entry level, especially here in Ventura County. We do struggle a little bit with affordable housing, but we're just in Turk County and Westlake and Thousand Oaks and all these cities. We're half a million dollar neighborhood to 600, 700,000, you know, so it, it's pretty, it's pretty crazy. So the other slide was again, inventory guys, look, look at this inventory. It spikes and it's all the way down. So again, we're limited inventory. I mean, you know, I, I, we live in Simi and if you got 95 houses, and there's out of 100,000, 120 plus thousand people living in here. That, that's that's pretty crazy. So as far as your competition, you don't really have competition. You know, you don't you don't have competition if you're going to put your house up. Now, I'm not saying you can always get the full crazy amount, but you never know. And this is price per square feet. I'll share, share with this all, all the slides and everything if you guys like. So, again, I hope you guys, you know, enjoy this Facebook. I hope you guys enjoy the stats. 
The other crazy thing I saw too, uh, and I'll send you with this article, California Association of Realtors put out this report, this annual report, and it's like 137 pages, but it shows all, let's see if I can kind of share with you guys. I'm still learning this software, so be patient. Um, yeah, it's not going to work, but it's okay. I'll send you guys a report, 137 pages, and it shows the real estate market from 1962 all the way to today's market in 2017. So I know it's been a long, drawn-out kind of you know Facebook Live, but yes, if you were to tell me today when is the best time to sell my house today, and if you're moving out of state, put your house on the market before the spring because the spring usually there's more people moving and the summertime, summertime as well, seasonal. It's always been, but it's been hit and miss. But if you're looking, hey, there's no inventory right now. Can I get top dollar? Can I get a buyer? Can I get to my next chapter? Yes, you can if it makes sense for you. So if you guys, you know, again, we appreciate all the support. I hope you guys enjoy this Facebook Live. Keep sending us the questions, man. I love doing videos like this. I hope you guys liked it. I hope I did okay. I'll get a little bit better at this uh, program. But, I mean, I, I, I love it. So I want to say thank you guys for all the love support. If you guys do me a favor, like this video right there. Follow us on Facebook, the Eddie Milanos Group. We got a goal of 5,000 people by the end of this year. Uh, again, thank you for like enjoying the caravan videos. It's a lot of work, but I think you guys are enjoying it. We got a lot of positive feedback. So, and from realtors too, man, I really appreciate you guys letting me film it. And I do get permission, but I want to say thank you guys for allowing me to film your houses and give you guys credit. And hopefully, I'm I'm able to sell some of those, even though I'm not representing some of the buyers. I hope you guys get some uh, buyers from that. So I'm, I'm fortunate. Um, that's about it, man. If you guys have any questions about this video, uh. Let me know if you guys have any other general questions about real estate. Reach out to us. Send us a Facebook message. Send us an email. I don't know, man. There's like 30,000 ways you can get a hold of us. Just figure it out. Send us send us a message. If you just have any general real estate questions, we're always happy to answer any of those. Um, so, yeah, guys, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the Facebook Live. I want to keep doing this. Eventually get some guests, uh, some lenders, maybe some uh, home inspections. Keep whatever you guys have questions on, man. This is great content for us and and you're not the only one that's asking that a lot of people are asking it so again i hope you guys appreciate this we want you guys to be knowledgeable when you buy and sell and, and we want we want to help you guys out too so again we appreciate all your love and support i'm done rambling i see the timer it's 22 minutes i think it's been on like 15 minutes sorry guys for the little delay but it is trash and i do have chores all right guys thank you very much let me know how i did uh again thank you for watching and uh that's it guys have a great night. Bye.